Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. You may recognize this setup from the outro of the last video. It is my first morning here in Florida. We landed last night at about 9 p.m. US time, which meant it was like 2 a.m. UK time. By the time we arrived here at my parents' house, it was about 4.30 a.m. UK time, so we were absolutely shattered. I'm actually the first one awake, so yeah, I think I'm gonna put a coffee on. Uh, because I've got a banging headache and I, it's either because I'm dehydrated because I didn't drink enough on the plane or because my body is like, Joel, this is 11.30 a.m. UK time, like give me caffeine and I have to train it. No, we're on US time now. <laughs> but anyway, I cannot wait actually for Keegan and the kids to get up because I can't wait to show them the house. Obviously, we arrived in the dark yesterday and we all just went straight to bed. So I cannot wait to just show them out here. They had a quick peek outside last night um, and I turned the pool light on and they were so excited. So I'm really, really looking forward to them seeing everything in the daylight. So these are my parents' keys for the, like the front gate, and that's the gym, and this is, I believe, for the owner's cupboard. So this is the cupboard which is out of bounds for any guests staying in the house because it's my family's cupboard. Oh, it's very tidy. Last time I was in here, it was very messy. Oh, yes, my mug. Is there a light in here? Where's my mug? There she is. <laughs> yes. So in the care package that mum and dad left for all of us, they've left some Dunkin' Donuts coffee. It's just like being at home. Isn't it funny that um, in Yorkshire, there's a Dunkin' Donuts near where we live. It's the only Dunkin' Donuts I've ever seen in England. I don't feel like we have Dunkin' Donuts that much in England. And it's a little piece of home, even though it's from America. Anyway, um, I, always forget how to use these coffee machines, like these filter drip coffee machines. So I'm gonna to have to try and work this out. Um, and I hope it's not too loud. Right, we are off for breakfast. And uh, we're also gonna stop at the supermarket on the way home to get some little bits for the house, some bread, some cereal. It is so hot, it's only like 8, 8.15. Right, so loud. It's very loud, isn't it? The car. I thought, I thought, am I revving that? <laughs> I'm not, it's just the engine. No. It's just an American car, big truck. Oh, nice. Right, AC on. AC like on. Pancakes. pancakes. Right, let me put in Kiki's slash Kekis. Let's have a Kiki. Let's have a Kiki. So we're going to go back the way we came. Lock the doors. Fire up the pancake machine. <laughs> I need to wipe the doors. Wipe so what? Oh, the mirrors, yeah. Driving on the right hand side of the road. Yeah, stick to the right hand yeah. side, please. I'm very excited because apparently they built some new houses uh, on, I don't know what they call it, I think they call them divisions. On this division, this development, yeah. Uh, uh, so I'm going to explore. Uh, I don't, if I was getting a house in Florida, I wouldn't want to get one of those houses. Oh no, because the pool they're um, overlooked. It's, it's yellow <laughs> and the, the pool is like. Yeah, but yellow's good because it. Was, yeah, but you can, everyone can see you in the pool. Mm -hmm. so you want a bit of privacy. <laughs> this is where we're coming, guys. I've actually only been here once, but the breakfast was incredible. Uh, the pancakes especially, so <laughs> let's go. So How shocked are you at the size of the pancakes? Huge. <laughs> <laughs> has gone for a waffle, very nice. Keegan and I have gone for a oh. egg white omelettes. Yeah. But we're hoping to get a taste of these guys. <laughs> Breakfast is done, we're absolutely stuffed and now we need to do a bit of a shop. I don't know if something's going on, like America 4th of July or something. Oh, this was the iced tea I was talking about. Mm. I was saying to the kids over that? breakfast that they sell iced tea by like the gallon. What I love about Publix, look how organised everything is. You don't get that in the UK. Very. The kids are buzzing at all the American cereal. I think they've never seen them more excited. I don't know what, I don't know what it is. Like. Oh my gosh, that looks so good. Chocolate strawberry Cheerios. Yes, we need some water because I don't like the tap water from in Florida. It tastes a bit strange. There he is. I could have taken the shopping cart there. Oh yeah, it's one just there. He walked all the way over there. That was so expensive. The nicest shop shopping attend, uh, person who works at the supermarket ever is like, thank you so much for bringing that back. Have an amazing day. Oh, and wow. I felt like it was genuine. 
Well, yeah, because it's what's weird in public is they get people to pack your bags for you, which is nice, and potentially take it to the car. He was like, do you want me to take it for you? I was like, no. But they wear a badge saying, no tipping, please. So they're not even being nice for a tip. Yeah. They're young though, aren't they? They're they like, are. They're kids. Uh, which is good. I'm glad that they give, that young kids can get jobs because they don't yeah. you know. But it's, young kids, a lot more difficult at home, isn't it? Because they're always saying, you need experience, you yeah. need experience, you need experience, but how is someone supposed to get experience? Well, exactly. Anyway, that was expensive. My estimate was $300 and it was $347, which is ridiculous. Was it? Yeah. I thought it was 346 Oh, um, I thought it was 47 Anyway. Uh, just under 350 yeah, basically. That, we, we, it's a good shot for, you know, two weeks. Uh, yeah. You know, we'll, uh, yeah, we'll probably have to come back, but... Not to do another $300 shot. Yeah, we will need to do a $300 shot. No. And it's saving us from eating out. Yeah, it's saving us from ourselves. Yes. I'm vlogging with both of your cameras. Look at my beautiful face. I don't think you are. Yeah, yeah, I am. Look. Oh, you recording. are. Well done. Yeah, see, I'm smart. Joel's just jumped in. Dad is currently in a mental state. And, um, mental state. yeah. What mental state, am I in? Good mental state. Are you going to be a vlogger? Are you going to be a vlogger when you're older? Yeah, what if I jumped in right now? I don't think I should kill you. But what if I kept your camera dry? Uh, then I wouldn't kill you. Stop messing around. Well, guys, it's the afternoon. We've done a lot, but also not a lot. As in, after the shop, we lay by the pool, went for a walk around here. Um, with the kids, just a short one. We've been by the pool, playing in the pool, haven't we? Marco Polo. Marco. Polo. And now me and Keegan have come to do a full walk just to get our 10,000 steps in. Because it's ruse it's... and knows it. Oh yeah. Um, we'll have a little oh, goss. Look, see, they've, that's a, is that a gay flag over that? Oh, there is. There's a couple of gay flags Seriously, around here. gay flags in Florida, so. I know. I think the issue is the governor, not the people. Yeah, it's Rhonda idiot. Not uh, the Floridian people. <laughs> Good one. <Nice. laughs> um, anyway, this is our first day here, obviously, as you guys know. And so we're just trying to get a tan. So we are walking topless. Um, hide Brits abroad. Put your, hide your wives away. Oof. Is that what they say? Lock, lock up your daughters. Lock up your sons. I always think lock up your daughters sounds a bit weird. It does a bit, doesn't it? Lock up your wives. Because it doesn't Perfect. specify how old the daughters are. <laughs> True. Lock up your wives is better and more accurate because I feel like... Middle-aged women love us. Do you know what I mean? Maybe not in that way. You saw modest then, No, but I don't think middle-aged women are attracted to us, but middle-aged women love hanging out with us because we are fun. I don't know why. Because we give off the same energy. We do. Anyway, so the division where the house is, they are actually building some new ones. You can see these white ones. They're 10 bed houses, starting at 1.5 million, which Ooh, is ridiculous. We'll have two. We'll have two. So we're just having a little walk down here, as you can see, they're in the process of building some and they're going to be building all on here as well, so it's going to end up being quite full. We have daydreamed about maybe buying a holiday home or something, so maybe we can rustle up enough funds. Not for one and a half million. <laughs> Not for one and a half million. Oh, that one's nice. That's huge. Whoa. Maybe that's one and a half million. Yeah, maybe that's one of the ten bed, one and a half mil ones. Yeah, these are big. Yeah. Whoa! Oh! A dragonfly just landed on my finger as I was filming. Yeah, these are huge! Right, so yeah, we've decided these must be the 10 beds because they're significantly bigger <laughs> than the other ones. They're absolutely ginormous. I don't even know if it's translating on camera just how big they are. They're going to be incredible. I wonder if they have big pools as well. Oh yeah, there are people still working, now available. We are at Olive Garden and I completely forgot to film the first lot of breadsticks and salad, but luckily we're so hungry that we've asked for a second, second round. You look so depressed. You are. Yeah. <laughs> um, what do you think to Olive Garden so far? Aren't they? I think they're the highlight for everyone. Very nice. <sighs> that was so good. How was it for you, Keegan? Yeah, that salmon was very nice. Yeah, that was very nice. So I'm just thinking so that full. waiter just made eight, seventeen dollars on our check, right? Yeah. So that, how many tables of four people is he doing in an hour? 
in an hour, maybe four tape. Yeah, four tables. So that's like an extra quick month. Yeah, three on the go. Yeah, yeah, three on the go. Then. Seventy dollars an hour, maybe. Extra. See, in the UK, waiters don't earn very much, do they? Whereas in the US, it's a lot. Not a bad job. It's not a bad job. And then, and they service. No, but I can't be bothered. I'm just do 20% as standard, unless it's awful, and then I would not hesitate in leaving zero tip. I think I have left no tip before in America, which is a real insult. But that was because the service was awful. Like it, it, I, I deserved a tip, but I, don't, I feel like the full 20% was not stretch. Yeah. Well, I like to be kind. That wasn't pointed at you. You can be anything. Be kind. Be kind. You can be anything. Be rich. <laughs> like Paris Hilton. Just stop being poor. <laughs> We've just found the best button, which says second row seat fold. Press it. <laughs> it hits them in the back of the head. <laughs> Rear view camera. Oh, no. oh that was fun. What else have we got? This Wagoneer is very technical. Mirror dimmer. It's very optical. Wagoneer. <laughs> this Wagoneer. Look, Ford's garage, that's opening soon. Garage. Garage. Um, I've been there once before in, in Margaritaville and it was very nice. There's a place is called Margaritaville. Margaritaville a real place? I know it's a song. No, it's a. Um, like a development, like something like this, but they're called Margaritaville. Am I going right here, Joe? Yeah. Because um, it says something about Margaritaville in the song, right? I don't know. Sing it. I don't know. That's it. The Margaritaville. Two Where you go when you are ill. Ooh. And then you take a pill. And then you feel like a hundred dollar bill. Uh -uh. <laughs> and you eat shrimp pill pill. It's called gambas pill pill. Oh, damn it. <laughs> oh. That was a good one. Oh, yeah. Should yeah. we stop at CVS before we go home? Yeah, I love CVS. Let's go. Sadly not. CVS is Keegan's favourite place on earth because it's just a pharmacy that sells everything. Everything. You know what I like about CVS as well? Their mission is obviously, like any other pharmacy, is to help mm. people get better. Yeah. And they stopped selling cigarettes. Whereas did they? other pharmacies didn't. Oh, I didn't know they stopped selling them. Yeah, they did. They still sell alcohol though, don't they? Yeah, I know. But it was, listen, this is a bro. Just, at least it's something. Their receipts are really big as well. That's one thing I always remember. That's what she said. <laughs> We're looking for some after sun, but can't see any. And then I'm like, does America even do after sun? Or maybe they, they must do it, but they probably call it something else. We're trying to find Fletcher some glasses. Why is my hat getting passed around today? Fletcher's worn my hat out to dinner, and now you're wearing my hat. Uh, for goodness sake. Everyone loves that hat. <laughs> I don't know why. Because you've got a massive fat head that fits everybody. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, well done. Oh, yeah. Iconic. <laughs> Taylor Swift. <laughs> it's going to get a moisturizer with aloe vera. We're getting some melatonin as well. Yeah. I think they don't call it after sun. No, it's after sun. After sun. It doesn't have an R in it. Oh, for goodness sake. Every day. <laughs> it's a joke that never gets up. <laughs> Guys, I like this. I'm like a Harry Potter. Oh god, I look horrible in the well, camera. You, know, you look like uh... Do I look like one of the three Don't blind mice from yes, Shrek? You do, yeah. Exactly <laughs> you. Fun fact, dairy milk in America tastes nothing like dairy milk in the UK really? because they've changed the recipe to suit the American palate. So it's not actually, when we tried it, we were like, finally, Cadbury's, but it doesn't taste the same. So just telling me all the American candies never have. <laughs> hint, hint. <gasps> Airheads. <gasps> Twizzlers. <gasps> Tackies. Oh, Tackies. Jesus. <laughs> they sound nice. 
Oh. I'm not saying we should get them, but should we get them? No. <laughs> right, guys, it is 9 p.m. and we're off to bed now. Very, very tired. We just played some cards and uh, had some chocolate. And um, yeah, it's not quite reached nine. It's very nearly nine. <laughs> but yeah, we've just had it now. Hit a wall. Um, it's what, nine, 10, 11, 12, one, two. It's 2 a.m. in the UK right now. So yeah, jet lag is hitting us. But thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please subscribe. I post videos every single week. And if you'd like to become a member and watch all my exclusive members only videos, then consider doing that. And I'll see you next time.